Hi everybody, this is C3 Readings and this reading is going to be for Gemini. Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs. Now Gemini, I have to tell you something. I was shuffling the deck and I just stopped. And this happened in your last reading as well. Okay, you want to know what? The lovers. In your last reading, if you go back and watch my last reading, there was lovers at the bottom of the deck. Mm hmm Now Karen is going to say, you made it up. Please don't be a Karen, okay? Um, because I didn't. I haven't got time to orchestrate these, okay? Anyways, um, that's a message in itself, okay, about love. Maybe love is on your mind. Maybe there's a connection coming in. Let's dive deeper into it. In case this reading resonates with you, you can check out the link in the description box to find out more about the person you're connecting with. How are they thinking and feeling about you? Their next moves towards you? Outcome of the situation between the two of you? Advice, oracle messages, love notes, messages from the universe, um, as well as um, message from spirit. You can also check out your 2021 forecast linked down below in the description box messages for gemini okay we have the ace of pentacles wow talks about uh, manifestation not to forget we have the magician at the bottom of the deck supporting it you know your overall energy is the magician i'm going to take it nine of pentacles so you're definitely coming from a tough place you're definitely um coming from a place where you felt defeated um i feel like some of you have also um been really stressed out okay so you really i feel like um you're reaching this stable place in the near future but we will see it's a pentacles a month of new beginnings okay a month of new opportunities okay is a time that you pay attention to what you're thinking what you're feeling because you are a very powerful manifester okay let's see I feel like um, I see a realization here happening. Um, Gemini, it's like, you know, when one is aware of their true potential and they really put in the work and effort towards it, it's like not being happy with the current situation and wanting to work towards a better situation, okay? Um, this could be about work or anything else, okay? You're reconsidering something here. What is it? And you're waiting on something. You're taking your time with something. Like I said, you're reconsidering something. You're thinking about something. Perhaps you're thinking about how to manifest that new opportunity for yourself. You want to have a new beginning in your job, in your career. You know, you, you're wanting this um, prosperous energy. Let's see though, let's see. Queen of Swords, yeah. I feel like in the past you dealt with somebody or there was a certain situation in your life where it really made you question your self-worth. It really made you question um, everything about that connection and i feel like at this time you're making a head over heart decision you're cutting somebody out of your life perhaps or you're having a very very logical approach towards something it's either one of those things or it's everything all together where i see you cutting somebody out of your life i see you um i actually see you being very determined 
to get something, to achieve something here. And it's a very, um, you know, I will do all that I can do approach. It's a very, um, I should say, it's a very hardworking approach, okay? So I feel like you're going to be getting a new opportunity. The universe is bringing this new beginning for you, but you have to explore it. You have to move towards it. And at times when we are not in the right mind space to attract this, we tend to not pay attention to this and rather we get distracted. So it's a message for you not to get distracted, but to work towards it, okay? Let's see, what do we have for Gemini? What do we have for Gemini? What do we have for Gemini? We have the Emperor energy. We have Aries energy here. Uh, taking back control, Gemini, okay? Really taking back control. Um, let's see, though. I feel like it's not going to be you who takes the initiative towards the other person, perhaps. I just see you having a very laid back approach, okay? Um, it's like a certain situation has opened your eyes. You've also uh, went through enlightenment, okay? You're, you're actually going through it. You know, God is enlightening you. It's, it's like really seeing the reality of a situation rather than, rather than trying to look at it with your... Um, rose-colored glasses on, you know? Yeah. I'm really seeing that there is this energy of wanting to work towards something, okay? But not making, but not making stupid decisions, okay? So I feel like it's a very um it's a very beautiful mind space it's a very logical mind space but also at the same time having the understanding okay to do things to work towards things perhaps okay um yeah I'm getting that it also talks a lot about expansion, okay, self-control. So this month overall for you, Gemini, I see you being the main focus here. I feel like the universe has definitely taken you through a journey. And it's like you are rediscovering yourself. You are letting your, you're the shining star here. Let me tell you that, okay, at this time many people are going to be witnessing your growth okay it's like a glow up that i see you having especially with that ace of pentacles energy it's like um a new beginning that is coming your way okay and i see a very winning energy okay Damn it. Okay. Wow. Uh, it's a very uh, deeply rooted energy, something much deeper um, than I can even explain. Okay. Some of you are also becoming very intuitive. Wow. And I feel like these energies will encourage you to look deeper within yourself as well. Some of you are making really important life changes, life decisions as well at this time. I'm going to take this one. We have the justice energy. We have Libra energy. Uh, I'm definitely seeing um, things moving towards prosperity and betterment for you, okay? Especially with that magician energy. I see you manifesting great, great things for yourself, okay? 
Ten of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. This is the ultimate, ultimate, you know, um, abundance, happiness, growth, transformation, right? Let's see. Some of you could also be waiting on some sort of a legal settlement or, you know, something like that. Something money related. Wow. We have the Ten of Pentacles again. Bottom of the deck, we have the King of Pentacles now. How many more Pentacles are you going to get, Gemini? So by the looks of it, um, you're reconsidering a situation where you were treated like an option and then you're choosing to move forward from it, you know. Uh, there's a lot of inner healing work that I see you doing. I feel like it's like contemplation, you know, looking back and learning from your mistakes as well as, you know, it's like a comeback when you take a step back from something and then you come back with a bang, you know. That's, that's the kind of energy I see for you. I'm even seeing... Um, marriage for you in the long run okay this is something that you have definitely consciously manifested in your life and it's coming in wow it's gonna be a roller coaster ride for you gemini um mainly if anything happens just remember this reading that it was supposed to teach you a lesson because there's a le learning lesson here as well for you. Money is looking really good though. As well as love. But you know. When it comes to love. I see you making decisions. Not to indulge in you know. Flings and stuff like that. The signs that I hear are Aries, Libra, Virgo, Gemini. We'll be connecting with air, any sign though we have it is safe for you to love open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all you know because i said that you are distancing yourself it doesn't mean that you distance yourself so much that you are not open to love at all okay yeah finances and career finances are going to be a big part um of your situation you may even meet somebody through work okay do check out the link in the description box, which is going to take you to the extended for further clarifications about the person you're connecting with. How are they thinking, feeling about you, their next moves, outcome advice, love notes, messages from the universe for you, okay, as well as what does your person want to say message from spirit do check it out will be linked below we have a win-win outcome is forecast again libra energy so it's all going in your own favor towards the end nothing to worry about okay that's it those were the messages that popped out for gemini i hope that you were open to receive these messages and i hope that you got something out of this reading if you really did do give it a like and subscribe to my channel Check out the extended link down below as well as your 2021 forecast, all right? And with that being said, thank you so much for being here. Take care and bye-bye.